conger eel. They're sustainable and delicious, but sadly, no one wants to eat them because they're so fucking ugly. Conger eels are monstrous creatures. They can grow up to 10 foot long and can weigh up to 250 pounds. Thousands of them live in the sea around Britain and it's a waste not to eat them. I've come to Exmouth to meet Dave Curley, who's one of the few people I could find who fishes for congers and he sells it in his fish and chip shack. Yeah, yeah. When was the last time you got your hair cut? Ah, oh, <laughs> weeks ago. <laughs> right. Huh? Like Duran Duran. Huh? These things are huge, aren't they? I mean, you they know, can be. Completely yeah. different yeah. to a freshwater eel. Related to the same family, but they're, I mean, they're humongous, yeah? Yeah. I've um, seen 100 pounds. 100 pounds? I've yeah. seen it, yeah. Conger eels often live inside wrecks, so we're heading out to sea to fish over one. The yeah. fascinating thing about conger eels, yeah. you know, they look fucking ugly. They are ugly looking, but you cut through that flesh and it's white gold. It is Beautiful. just, it is lovely, and it just hasn't quite got the flavour of cod, but you're going to prove me wrong with that today. Yeah. We'll be catching the congers with rods, which is going to be a real challenge as they're very difficult to fish. So it's going to be a slow tug, 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 and then bang. Bang, yeah. and when you know it's on, it's on. When they're on, they're, they're ferocious, aren't they? Ah, oh, it's non-stop. It yeah. is actually physically very yeah. tiring to get yeah. one up from the surface. Congers are tricky to catch because they live within the wreck. They come out to take the bait and then nip back into hiding. You got something on? Yeah. Oh, he's got something on there. Damn. Fucker's gone. Just come off there. Damn. I load up my hook with more bait and try again. Well done. Uh, they're biting. Yeah. This is definitely a conger on here, Gordon. Is it? Oh, he's gone. No, no. Oh, oh, shit. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why are they coming off so fucking frequently? It's frustrating but exciting at the same time. He's on. Jesus Christ, they're so strong. Oh, there he is. Fantastic. Shit. What size is that? That's casserole size, I call it. Bloody hell. That's not bad, is it? Not bad at huh? all, no. God, they're so strong. Fuck. We'll uh, go absolutely Right fancy. now? Yeah, I think if you just jump them straight across there. These buggers can really bite, so the quickest and most humane way to kill them is to sever their spinal cord. That's it. That's it. Jesus Christ. You got him. <laughs> I think you got him. <laughs> Bouillabaisse is one of my favourite French fish dishes, but I want to create a British version using conger to show Dave and his customers that this eel can be even more delicious. So we're going to season it first, OK, and start the process of a conger eel bouillabaisse, yeah? Okay. Very similar to a classic French bouillabaisse, but no grey mullet, no monkfish, no prawns, no lobster, just, right, just, just, just conger. Pure conger. Olive oil. Then add a little black pepper, salt and saffron. Oil in, skin side down, into the pan. Okay. And this one... We're going to start getting the vegetables going. Nice hot pan. Add some olive oil, fennel, carrots, celery and star anise. Crush a whole garlic, add a handful of shallots and lastly, cayenne pepper. That puts a little bit of heat inside the soup and really helps the season. Give that a little stir for me, please. Okay. So we can take that out and we've got a the colour there. That's all we wanted on there. Fish in, but it smells amazing. Lovely. To glaze the pan, so a little bit of perno. Then sit down, set fast in the shack. <laughs> Woo, shit. Burn off the alcohol. And uh, mix in the vegetables. Yeah, and the fish, okay. evenly. Add a splash of wine, fish stock, potatoes, fresh tomatoes, basil, and parsley to finish the dish. Cook it out for 20 minutes, and then we're going to blend it. Oh, that's all right. Okay. okay, buddy. Should we go? Yes. Look at them all. Fish and chips is off the menu. Yes. Can we try? Yeah, please. Conger eel. That's good. That's Very good. It tastes like a little bit like chop. It does taste like fish. It is absolutely delicious. I'm a mix. We love conger. It's so frustrating that we do not eat enough conger eel. So. Please start buying it because in there they clearly loved it. It may be ugly, but it's fucking delicious.